I'm a big fan. I am a huge fan of those type of practices where it's unopposed. I know there's been lots of debates um, over time, and these debates will probably continue, you know, uh, even when I decide to hang up my boots as a coach, where we look at unopposed and opposed practices. Now, the key thing for me was, was and always will be the environment. You've got to understand your players and what's in the best interest for them. So it all depends on where they're at, whether it's foundation phase or youth development phase, or it could be even, you know, professional development phase. You've got to understand your environment and what's key for your players. So looking at that, that session there, I really appreciate the detail that was given to the players. It wasn't too much and it wasn't uh, too little. And what was also pleasing for me is something that I really enjoy is players giving their feedback. And something that, you know, just I would have liked to have done with something similar to this with my players is get their ideas and what they believe is good for them in those type of situations. Because let's be honest, as, as practitioners, as coaches, we're not the ones that's going to be on the pitch. So sometimes it's also good to get the players' feedback and see what ideas they have. Because as much as they are striving to be players, they're also small coaches too. So when they're on that field, they have to make those decisions. And having this type of practice in that type of environment where there's not too much pressure, they can also be very relaxed in what decisions they make going forward. That way it gives them room to, to, to think for themselves individually and collectively. When I'm on the field on a Saturday or Sunday in, in, in game practice, what do I need to do? That way their decision-making can become a lot more relaxed when they're in opposed situations. So for me, the practice was overall was, was, was on point. I really enjoyed it. Like I said, I enjoyed the players' participation. And as Paul said it as well, they love putting the ball in the back of their net. 